has a Bowser, kind of has a Wario, uh, but mainly I see Wolf. I mainly see Wolf. Okay, going on Battlefield. This is kind of interesting. I think Donkey Kong can do pretty well on any stage. I think having platforms helps him greatly, being able to use that. Oops. Being able to use the... Oh my god, why am I drawing a blank? What do you call it? It's called the Ding Dong, of course. Get that headbutt. Sweet. All right, now I'm being joined by Korean. How you doing, man? Uh, doing all right. Yeah, I'm doing good. It's just another Wednesday night fight, you already know. Yep, 1.5. Oh, yeah. So, let's see here. So, the, the buff ASK, I guess, something to do with his upbeat. DK players want his upbeat to get a buff. Because it's yeah. pretty booty. Yeah, the uh, distance that it travels got half. And uh, they lose the invulnerability on the first hit. Okay, here's the edge guard. Oh, goes high, but that last clip. You're going to get YMCA out of that sticky situation. Giant punch. No punish off the sidestep. Yeah, not really getting a whole lot off of that. Oh, there's the yellow up the dash tag. <laughs> Didn't get the sweet spot. Even if he did, he might not have killed, but the Nair. No tech zone. Yeah, and that is a really good edge guarding option from Wolf. Gets the trip. Oh, falling there as well. It's going to be big damage here. Tech chase on the platform. Huge extension here. So many up airs. Even with the pivot laser. He even got the laser, too. That was actually sick. I yeah. love that. Using every bit of what platforms are supposed to be used for on a battlefield. That was great. Yeah. Oh, and the back air sweet spot does take it. Such an early stock here for K9. Big body. That's what happens. Oh, and to the dash attack. Yeah. K9's basically programmed that into the repertoire of things to do. Down throw into dash attack. Oh, okay, but YMC is firing back. He doesn't care. Yeah, really good juggle situations here. K9 just desperately trying to get back onto the stage, but YMCA keeping up the pressure, finally gets off from the ledge, shooting out some lasers, but back into the air he goes, and the up air to seal it out. Wow, that was a really confident up air. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and I back mean, to 1-1. Up air, such a strong move for DK. It comes out really quick, um, and it's just really strong. Covers a lot of area as well. Mm, I wonder if you can land with up air. I know that sounds crazy, but like, if you have a really big body, Oh, yeah, you can definitely line those up there. I, I've seen it done. Probably not going to be doing it to Wolf anytime soon, but I like these up tilts. Up tilt seems to be a really huge move in a YMCA's arsenal, and I can only really blame him. It's great. Yeah, Donkey Kong is Donkey Kong tilts are generally like really, really strong. Um, tangible arms, and they have insane range. Very, very quick. Covers a lot of area. Hey, so uh, Neutral B doesn't send you into free fall anymore. Yep. That's nice. That's nice. Yeah, really nice change. Oh, forward tilt? No. Mm, dash A. Breaking it through. God. When you look at dash attack and just how much area you cover, it's like not only are you moving tremendously, it's a mobile move, but then you send them so far back. Yep. And there is the back roll, the classic. If you got that back throw, kill throw, just get the roll behind. Push up in there, get the back throw in. Man, going to get the kill at 180%. And that was so close. YMCA was at a very high percent. He had all that rage. Definitely could have sealed out the stock from K9. Yeah. I've heard somebody equate DK to a sword character because of his, like, his forward tilt and just everything that he's got. I think that's kind of ridiculous, but... Oh, yeah. yeah. What you were saying about his tilts, they're insane. Like, uh, down I, if I'm not mistaken, down tilt has like a 30% chance to trip you um, from Donkey Kong. I know in Smash 4 it was about there. I'm, I'm not 100% sure in this game. But it, it definitely has a pretty high trip rate. I, I've seen that move trip quite a lot. Mm, and this is the uh, Lucina that I mentioned earlier. I, you know, I don't exactly hate this for Lucina, but it's not as bad as it may seem on paper. Because Donkey Kong is crazy, right? Oh, yeah. Um, I, I don't think Donkey Kong really loses too much in the range department. Um, he definitely has a really good burst option to open Lucina up. But no double jump here, and the charge F smash barely missing. Oh, yeah. That was some uh, awareness of character, being able to avoid that forward smash. Yeah, just barely forward smash. That shield was looking so low, almost getting it with that uh, side beat from YMCA. It does do a lot of shield damage. Yeah, Kena is just throwing out aerial after aerial. Oh, this could be it off the platform. Yes, it, it was. Is. Yep. And uh, that's the, the classic Smash 4, man. The Ding Dong still exists, especially on a stage like this. You know, if you get the extension on the platform, which you can jump up to, and this stage, like, the platform is so gigantic. It takes up so much of the room. Yeah. Solid back here, right yeah. there from K9 to close it out. But it, it's just, 
it's so hard to avoid because he can jump pretty much anywhere on the stage onto that platform. And this stage has very low blast zones. Like, the, the blast zones are just really small. Yeah, they do. Uh, it seems like uh, Donkey Kong is one command grab away from being a bona fide grappler character. Like, the king of this game. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. If he had a command grab, that was like low key. Oh, this is <laughs> Again? Look, unfair? Yeah. Look at that. Yeah, Same he, way. K9's got to be really careful, man. He, um, For the most part, a lot of Lucina's things are safe, but um, one thing that is committal is that dancing blade, and we saw K9 commit to the dancing blade, especially underneath that platform at around that 70% mark. He died to it at the first stock, so he's got to be really, really careful at around those percentages. Oh, yeah. I saw something really interesting. YMCA had a perfectly spaced, like, max range back air on Lucina's shield, and she was still able to add a shield forward air. Like, no problem. Oh, yeah. Like, wow. Yeah, Lucina's out shield options are very long range. They are pretty quick as well, and there's the Nutra. The edge guard does find its mark here for K9. Yeah, magical. Again? You're, are you dead? <laughs> that would have sucked. <laughs> oh, okay, whipping that, that has serious implications. Okay, good back here, though. Okay, the edge guard here. No, why is he going to stay on stage? Good for this ledge trap here. Dashing around, throwing out some of these hitboxes. Almost gets that pivot grab. Almost. Oh, oh, the, the armor. berry. Oh, didn't get the smash. And YMCA is like, no, we saw that. Dang. And sometimes it, uh, it'd be like that sometimes. And yet, yeah, definitely had the uh, the stock there. Okay, the oh, back air. Okay. Yeah, definitely going to steal it out there. The and foot. <laughs> YMCA was uh, sweating right there because he definitely could have lost that, had the max rage on Lucina. He was only at about 40, so he's still like pretty comfortable in terms of percentage. Yeah. But that's when it starts. That's when it can start getting tilting because, like, say you start getting juggled to like 100, and you're, you're oh, the only thing you're thinking in your head is just like, I should have won it. this game. Like, I had th it. This game should just be over. We should be playing game three right now. Yeah. So th those are potential tilters, but YMCA closes it out with the foot. Good stuff to him. Yeah. Yeah, I saw him pop off in game. He just, he like jumped from behind the TV. All right, going back to Battlefield. Looking good, looking good. Yeah, no, um, no ban on Battlefield. We're going to have larger ceilings here. A little bit more situational on the uh, the ding-dongs on stage, the up throw combos Whoa. extended on the platforms here. And I just feel like in game one, we saw Kanai really utilize the platform so for some of those platform extension juggles. Yeah. Um, and the platform tech chases as well. Spy versus Spy? What is Tomahawk talking about? He's a crazy <laughs> person. <laughs> You're a crazy person, Tomahawk. And already 58. Yep, very uh, solid uh, convergence here coming out from K9, especially on the Donkey Kong, definitely going to be very, very true. I got to say, uh, this seems to be a constant with big characters, but cross-ups are not fun for Donkey Kong whatsoever. And this is a character, Wolf does cross-ups like it's a job. Oh, yeah. Wow, he was able to turn around down smash. Tries to go for the down air. Gets the last hit and sends him out with that up beat. K9 goes for the nair. Yeah. Gets the trump. Okay, but I mean, he still got a good amount of damage here, but wasn't able to seal it out. Donkey Kong is back on stage, though, where he can be such a terror. And like you said, the cross ups, man, all day long. All day. And I mean, like, there's some heavy. I mean, not some, but like. Bowser is a really good character that is heavy, that can deal with cross-ups really well. But um, Donkey Kong does not have that luxury. No, he doesn't. I mean, if like if aerial sp or uh, regular Spinning Kong were able to like change in its trajectory instead of just going straight forward, you might have something. But uh, that's not how Donkey Kong works. Okay, trying to get back on stage here on the ledge, the forward oh. tilt. No armor. That was hopeful. Yeah, and I wonder if the armor just ran out because, I mean, essentially that option should beat it out. Yeah, it, maybe it's because it was a multi hit Maybe, yeah. I mean, I don't, I don't think that's how it works, but um, not, not too sure. But at, at the end of the day, the board tilt did connect, and good stuff to K9. He's gonna seal it out. Um, gets the first stock. Already racking up 91% in the oh. back air. Because oh. oh. he extended his hurt box when he used that nair. Yeah, that I was mean, unfortunate. Essentially, YMCA kind of greedy there. He, he burned his double jump. This should be dead here. Got oh him. no! Well, oh, he almost made it back. Yeah. Everyone that says Wolf of Kirby's like, I don't know, man. <laughs> the characters are going pretty darn good. It's better than <laughs> most people <laughs> let on. Yeah, sure. oh yeah, for sure. But yeah, essentially YMCA just, uh, you know, he kind of extended with that double jump there on his second stock. He lost the stock for it. He does get this um, first stock off of K9, but there's two more remaining, and the percentages are about even here. So he's going to have to have a really good comeback, but already K9 just racking up this percent, something Wolf is no stranger oh, to. Rolling in, that was not the play sheet. 
Okay, the dash dance, forward smash, very safe here. Another Nair, and K9 is just doing such a good job of controlling all this center stage area, just making it so difficult for YMCA to get it back. A Nair gets him back on stage, but up we go once again, back to the ledge. I like how I saw YMCA try to use down B as a landing option. This might be a dead wolf. Yeah, you just can't make it back. Yeah, that's a hard counter. Woo. All right, 160% here on this Donkey Kong. Can YMCA make this comeback? Oh, wait a minute. Here's oh. the damage. The juggles? Uh, not quite getting the string that he needed. Maybe a bit more patience in being able to, you know, get his neutral going. And K9 is uh, playing very safe here. We are seeing the blaster put to work. Oh, yeah. 199, oh. almost at 200. Oh, this back throw should... Oh, forward throw. Okay, I mean, oh, dang. Okay. Oh, oh dang. He okay. punched him. Punched him right in the face. Yeah, K9 and still has the center. All right, see, when, when you get shook as Wolf, that's when the more blasters come out. So he got punched right there. The blasters are going to work. This gun might actually overheat. The back throw. Oh, he could have got it. Oh, get man. It. This is so close. Okay, the forward throw. Calm kill. down. Calm down. Oh, okay. Calm down. All right, all right. Calm okay. down. Okay. Woo. <laughs> That was that was pretty nuts. YMCA had a lot of close calls. Yeah, a lot of close calls. A grab on the platform definitely could have been it with that max rage. Most people would have said that was last stock, last hit. Yeah, yeah. I mean, seriously, uh, what was Wolf at sixty? Yeah, he was at sixty. Yeah. Max rage donkey. All you had to do is do another ding dong. That probably would have been it. Yeah.